Thanks for meeting me. Thanks for asking me. Um, do you want a coffee? I was gonna wait, but the waiter came round and I just said, that's right. <laughs> so, so. <laughs> um, something's been really bugging me and I just wanted to ask you. Why did you come to my apartment that day after I saw you and Darcy in the park? Um, I told you I wanted to make sure you were all right, which you clearly were, by the way. And that's it? Why are you asking me this now? That was over three months ago. No reason. Um, you don't have to tell me. It's not like we're friends or anything. That's right, we're not. <laughs> I don't know, I've just been, just been thinking about things and Beck asked me to move in with her and um, then you don't want to. I didn't say that. But you didn't say yes. I don't know, I just, I need to think about it. Look, I know I'm not your friend, but <laughs> Could we try and start over again? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure Darcy would love that. This has nothing to do with Darcy. We're not together. I don't think so. Let's pretend we just met. That our mutual friend Augusta just introduced us. Augusta. Hmm. That's right. <laughs> and where is Augusta now? Oh, she had to take her dog to the vet. He's sick. But it's okay, he's just got a cold. So Augusta had to take a sick dog to the vet for a cold? It's more like the flu. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, I can't. Okay, but um, <coughs> if you change your mind, this is my address. If you ever feel like dropping by, you could get this from Augusta, but while we're here. You wanted to see me? Uh, yes. Take a seat. Grace tells me you're a good lawyer. Oh, well, compared to her. Sorry. She also tells me that you're bored. She is full of information today, isn't she? Why do you want to work here? Same reason I became a lawyer in the first place, to do some good and help people. It's not because no one else will hire you? Am I being fired? Not yet. See, I'm just having trouble reconciling what I hear with what I see. Do you mind? Sorry. Because on the one hand, I'm told you're a good lawyer. But then on the other, you wander in late, and you disappear for hours at a time, and one of the conditions of your employment was three months probation with mandatory counselling. Do you care about this job? Yeah, I do. Okay. Then prove it. Okay, what's this? That's your new case. I still have a wheat left on my probation. I really don't think I should be taking on any new cases. I'm willing to make an exception. Your clients are in the meeting room, Taylor, seven, and Ashton, four. Their mother's just been released from custody after five months. A break and enter without violence. There's a history of drug use. The children have been in interim care, two different foster homes. Hello. They're not talking. Well, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Thank you. It's all right. Thought I was going to be stuck out here all night. Yeah, well, you know, if we live together. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Yeah. I know. Do you want to come in? Maybe. That looks fancy. What is it? It's an invite to my dad's wedding. I didn't know he was getting married. Yeah, neither did I. Dance with me.